The sands of Voyanui's desert domain are hot and dangerous. Behind the walls of the fortress called Avak's throne lurks the stone paraka Avak. I couldn't have I couldn't have known that. Who is as merciless as the dunes that surround him? That's a little voice there for you. Oh, oh, of course, the dunes, and I spawn in a uh, jungly area. Kumarok says, uh, uh, Thok could, could make himself crazy. Excuse me, I'm talking to the wall. Excuse me, this wall is my friend. Well, that's a cool boy, Nui. Texture, very low res. Very, very cool, very low res. I mean, for, for, for this, this, this book. Like for being a DS game, this is oh, like okay. a very nice There's the zoom. Wow. It's a very for icy zoom. <laughs> some biofan asks, can we buy some Hookie merch in 1.5? Kind of. I don't really want to say more more about it than that, but also hold on, listen to the bass in this in this song. It's so good. I don't I don't I don't hear bass. Oh come that's, on. That's pretty good. I hear it. It's pretty good. I mean, it's it's DS based, mm. but uh, it, it's mm. it's good for the DS. Like, if anything, it's a great it's a great uh, soundtrack. Yeah, just the, the soundtrack in this game is fantastic. Oh, look at that! That is really I, cool. This is very strongholdy. Yeah, that's um, a cool looking kakama. Ooh, ooh, spinny gun. Oh, uh, it's, it's, it's garbage. It's a new, new, uh, new toa. So, yes. Yeah, new toa. And Some as per standard, says, new toa is garbage. Yeah. Some biofan says, can we go snowboarding in Kauai in 1.5 like in Bionicle the game? I wish. It's it's just a very complicated thing to design. Um, yeah. <laughs> where you need like sliding physics and you need to have the animation and you know everything. I think it was on the wish list for it, Legacy, it but was. it was make the final cut. And it is still on like the wish list for. Um, I might even be in the like full design of the uh, 2.0 as well. I'm not sure. I think it's on the wish list for 2.0, right. so it might happen, it might not. The freaking bass has turned it up now. I turned up the bass. Turn up mm. the intensity. Cookie looking holy uh, here. He's just like, oh. You don't see that? Some biofan asks, will the stone that holds the Evoki be hidden somewhere in Tawahi in 1.5? Ooh, that's a good point. I should add that. Uh, it's currently not in 1.5. Joe Cool might add it now, yeah. <laughs> but it's not in 1.5. But I, I will say it, uh, it might crop up in 2.0. Mm. You'll, you'll yeah. have to keep your eyes open. Also, by the way, I just wanna, I just wanna bring attention to this. Investigate the fortress. Thank you. In other, in other words, shoot everything you see. Investigate the fortress. This is a discussion that yeah. uh, Joe Cool and I have had a lot because I agree with you, Lurk, uh, Lurking Carrier. Finding proto pools in Legacy is an absolute nightmare. It's a bit easier I, now. And it is, luckily. It is easier now. Uh, Thanks mainly to Daz. because of me. Yeah. Because I went in and I actually put proto pools in convenient locations because apparently. Joku wanted it to be as hard as possible to get <laughs> and use mass power. Not that I don't hard. It's it. just that I think it, it's just that it's very hard to design stuff like this because I'm so used to the game uh, that like you know I'm constantly you know playing it, so I know are. where all the protocols are. So to me, it, they're super convenient because they're like, oh, there's one right there, and I can just go grab it. But for people who don't uh, know, but you gotta remember, you yeah. gotta remember, people don't know that. People don't know where those are placed. Yeah, for and people who don't, not, know like, it's like you know, and most people don't know that you can use the mask of x-ray vision and see them through the walls <coughs> sorry I'm a little sick um can I, can I just intervene while, while you uh fix your throat sorry yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> i want to i i, I, I want to get actually get in on this on this topic because i do i do i do want to say that because I, I when i was playing the game i i have no i had no issue with the with the uh the stuff being uh not not like easily accessible i thought i thought like it, it gave me a reason to uh, to explore the island but i can understand if you if you don't want to explore the island you just want to well, like, run around there are plenty it's of annoying. uh i i will say that yes you can use the x-ray vision but that also drains your protodermis so exactly. it, it, exactly. it, it, it is the whole reason why you want to get your protodermis back to begin with also, so I, I understand why adding more would it's going to make it better i don't know if we want to say what we have sort of for the what? end game protocol solution what do you um, I mean, it's not super yeah it's not super it's not super really critical it basically uh once you get the gold mask you use a lot less protodermis when yeah, you use yeah. mask powers so gold mask uh, so yeah, the gold masks do actually do something now. They add stat yeah. buffs to your stuff. Um, it, it's to a point where it's noticeable, which is is nice. 
Uh, I, okay, I, yeah. I, I wanted to say this earlier, but uh, Yoko was was having a having a cough. Yeah. Um, uh, with, with the with like that whole uh, rock with, with the Avoki thing in it, you should, you should just put an actual Avoki inside that rock. I mean, well, it's you put you put the Avoki <laughs> inside there, and then you can use the mask of extra vision. Ah, uh, right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that'd be cool, actually. I didn't. I I I, I, was, I was just thinking, why don't you clip the camera into the rock? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but the Daz is here, like, hey, let's make let's do some logic into it. Yeah. yeah. And, and, uh, you wouldn't be able to interact with it in any way, but. It'd be like, oh, hey, cool, look at that. Some Vio fan asks, in 1.5, uh, will you be able to see more Matoran like Takua or Kangu? Uh, absolutely. Yep. More uh, of the famous Matoran yep. are included. I'm trying to make sure each one, at least from Minog, like that you interact with is, is in yeah. there. It's a difficult thing to do. But yeah, there's definitely going to be a lot more recognizable Matoran. Samuel says, uh, Very well, hopefully the new placements won't need to use the Yaku so much for that. Yes, yeah, not uh, as much. You'll yeah. definitely be able to find oh, hey. find protocols a lot easier now. That was very uh, level designy. I like that. So this is like this is where I came yeah. in, and I, I came in and right, I right. saw this, and I was like, oh, that's where I need to get. And then I went around the whole place. Right, and right. I came out here. And there um, was also the meditation stones, which people don't really know about yet. So they're, that they're is similar to a new feature uh, protocols, but they're not as like more useful the, in my opinion. They're not limited like protocols are. Yeah. yeah. Meditation stones, uh, they refill your health and stamina to full on yeah. all the Toa. That's and they, a lot they more also, useful than yeah. protocol. And then they also save and let you switch the time. So yeah. Um, some biofence says, can we fight evil Liwa in 1.5? Uh, I know you're referring to the uh, Onua Liwa fight. So yeah. not that one, but I don't want to spoil anything else. So I'll just say that. In 1.5, will the telescope be controllable? Yes. Yes. Ooh. Yep. That is uh, one of the cool things. I think things. it's already actually, in there, actually. <laughs> yeah, it's it already might in 1.4. There are, is that? Oh, right, right. Yeah. Stolen that, keep. Smash through the guardians of the inner halls to Avax keep. Cool. Is, that, is that one Matoran uh, is still holding uh, oh. his uh, tool like, like a gun? Yeah. Oh, look at that. It's it's already stream time. She oh. comes over. <laughs> uh, do we want to keep wow. going? Uh, I, I mean, I say we, we go for another hour because none of us realized it. Yeah. So, some biofan says, so can we use an Akaku on the telescope and see someone in the red star like we can? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> that would be kind of kind of interesting, though. Uh, but no. You can, you can look at the red star, but you can't uh, see through the red star. Yeah, that would be wacky. Lurking oh, Carrier says, some biofans, that would only work with the Akaku Nuva, which allowed Gali to share the power with the telescope. I wish I knew what the, what, what we were talking about. Uh, the know. Nuva masks, uh, they allow you to share powers. I understood that. Like, that, right. that didn't go over my head. Part of that went over my head was the whole leak on is in the red star. <laughs> when you die, you go to the red star. That's that's where dead people go and buy on the yeah. They uh, go there to that, get a new body built for them. Is that unless, um, unless your body was destroyed, like, entirely? Some like that so yeah. lee kong could there come back they show stuff they can't come back yeah so, you can't come back from the red the, star yeah <laughs> it's supposed to fix you and send you back but the sending back things didn't really work we only wrote half the code yeah the, co the code yeah. had yeah. A, a major bug in it where uh, if it got disconnected from the rest of the robot, then it uh, it just happened to entirely break the sending back function. Yeah. Some biofan says, uh, the Red Star can only resurrect beings that aren't severely damaged, so Sidorak can't come back from the key. He got the demolished. Key, do not... His, okay, his head me. is just gone. It's 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 in the pavement. <laughs> the part is a part of the pavement now shame, in, that, in Metronui. You go back to Metronui, well, like when they go back after they were on Mananui, and they just see Sidorak's head in the pavement. <laughs> it's just like, I it's mean, just like a face imprint. Oh, Kumo Rocks is uh, giving Sidorak a burn here. The only lay he ever got was by a grumpy non-gender cyclops. <laughs> <laughs> Is it Kitonga another, another thing that has like three different, the three different things has, has the same name? Uh, um, no, no, I think there's no. only one. Well, well like... Kitongu is a race, a Rahi race, but most of them were killed except for one. Yeah, and okay. uh, well, he also does go by the Kitonangu. Well, in our headcanon. <laughs> no, no, in the movie. It's just Mata that says it. Yeah, oh. I, I figured. Oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a very yeah, fitting I... thing for Mata to say. <laughs> Uh, some biofan asks, how many cosmetics can we expect to see? I think there's, there's a fair few. Yeah, I, I would have to count it, but I think there's like 10. Without like naming them, there's that... That uh, one. Well, I, I that one. <laughs> that, that one, and that one, and then that one. There's the, uh, 
can't even say like any of that because I would be spoiling how to get it. You I'll, can, I'll just count them through my head. Well, so. there, yeah, there are some that are in like 1.4, so there are some that you can talk yeah. about, like the um, yeah, the shoulder, the shoulder things. But there are yeah, quite a few the, that you can't talk about. There's that one that uh, mm -hmm. that you and Marco were working on for a oh, long time. Yeah. Well, the the one that Marco told me to work on for a long time, and I didn't, and then I right. finally did. Right. And now yep. Marco's super yep, happy one. with it, and he wears it all the time. Uh, then there is the one you did recently. Oh, right. The one yep. that, that I groaned one. about. <laughs> yeah. The one um, that you groaned about that you said that's great. I groaned, but it's great. Uh, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's great. Um, yeah, there, there are a fair few... Uh, extra cosmetics that i'm not oh so i either don't know about or i'm not thinking of. only you're supposed to go down <laughs> so yeah, the end this is the end of the level yeah. some bio fan asks when completing the game will there be credits of matoran representing team kinohi dancing and lee coral in 1.5 i don't think so uh i don't are we i haven't done anything special for the credits yet okay um i'm considering it but there's there might be something happen. along those lines um but in 2.0 there's definitely going to be something like that uh i'm I'm not gonna directly say what it is it, you you'll have to do some searching for it but uh there's gonna be some uh references to dev matoran in there yeah hey, isn't this the theme music like oh this is like the intro music right for the game it's got the wah. i don't i don't know i'm not a music guy so i <laughs> these I, I know what i like but i'm not gonna be able to recognize it come on <laughs> i mean Okay, that was that thing. I'm just, I'm, I'm just doing that because like I, I don't know if it's me being like, or, or just, just me being a detail-oriented person, or if it's just you being the other way, <laughs> like right. not paying attention. So I'm, I'm not sure if, if I don't know which oh, way I'm, it's going here. I'm definitely not paying attention to the music, so it's, it's partially right. that. I, I'm not <laughs> even, I'm not even talking about just that. I'm talking about like the other day in Legacy where you put a meditation stone right next to a meditation oh. stone. Oh yeah, that. <laughs> I don't. I don't even know what happened there. I. I. I've got no answers for you on that. That was a very, a very confusing moment when I saw that, which obviously nobody Lurking knows Curry what we're talking says, about. Yeah, Lurking uh, Carry says it is the title theme, so this is the same music as the. Right. Yeah. Uh, some bio fan asks in Poe Coral, will we see Capra there looking at the sunset with some racks and in one point five? Uh, that's a good point, actually. I need to add that. <laughs> yeah, that, that'd be a, a cool Also, thing. something that I saw I saw that was absolutely awesome was, I don't know who did it. Uh, it may have actually been some bio fan, but somebody in Stud.io put together Kapura on the beach looking at the sunset nice. in, in a reference to that. And that nice. was just awesome to me. Lagging out. Oh, what's this? What? What is that? Is, what the heck is that? It's like a slicer. Is that supposed to be like a spiny stone ape or something? Maybe. It looks like a slicer to me for some reason. Oh, he's gone. So, oh, some bio fan says, yeah, that was me that did that. The Lego, oh, right, yeah. the Lego thing on the beach. Yeah, sweet. Thank you for doing that. That was very cool. Yeah. To see. Yeah. Wow. Is, is, it, is it a secret or is it where you're supposed to I go? I think this is a secret or where I'm supposed to go. I don't know. It looks it like feels a, a secret. It a bit long for a secret. Yeah, it does feel a bit long for a secret, though. Oh, no, it is a secret. Ta-da. So you can, oh. it needed to lead me back around to here. Right, all right. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nobody laughs at my jokes about you. How you always say right, and I, I always just say right a bunch. Oh. Just to, to imitate well, I don't you. <laughs> think people, I don't think people realize it's you being imitational. I think it's, they just think it's just you also saying right. Right. I do say right a lot, though. That's just my <laughs> yes, like, standard do. response. People Goodness. have misconstrued it for like sarcasm before, like I'm saying <laughs> right. Right. Stuff like that. Yeah, but I mean, it, I, that is your thing, though. So. It is just my thing. I'll just type right when I when I Lower am just agreeing no, with something yeah. or lowercase no no punctuation, just right. It I mean, works. It's, it's better than just typing K. <laughs> like K K feels bad when you like type out this long thing and you just get K. Okay. Unless it's like warranted for the situation, or it's like I'm bug fixing, and then you're like, here's this massive expl explanation of a bug, and I'm like. Okay, thank you, thank you for telling me this horrible information. Although in those situations, I find it's better to just like reply with a, a reaction, like a, a variation of a, a head desk gif, you know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. One of those. Very appropriate for how I feel when I when I'm trying to fix yeah. bugs and yeah, and and we have found a fair few 
pretty pretty fixed a lot but, as well which is yeah. good yes they have so the game will be a bit more stable when it comes out including performance uh in 1.5 oh. or 2.0 will the disc finder matoran be present or have dialogue slash um, subplot slash side quest? i'm not familiar with the disc finder matoran who are they i don't know um but this is awesome he's just chilling on his throne and i'm in here and i'm like hey how's it going oh uh, she's gonna hello sir uh, okay should i shoot him he no looks, he looks really cool though it, he, it, he really it, doesn't care about me though he's so like intimidating that he doesn't even need to acknowledge that you're here that's super interesting okay let's shoot him now going back to your question there can carry your uh, <laughs> could you please tell us who the disc finder matoran are because i'm not oh, he's so intimidating look how freaking massive he is all the proc are huge yeah it's just so terrifying because like oh now he's running where'd he go where did he go what's his what the heck i don't know what's his uh up, up what's his top, quirk up on top there's vaki up there yeah but what's his quirk though? i don't know what his quirk is oh and there's a turret here oh yeah i forgot avak has turrets there he is oh there he goes he jumped into the universe oh okay the disc finder matorn are the matorn who found the great discs in the 2004 art oh uh, what you mean the toa metru yeah well no no, no the matorn that the toa metru have to find who know where the great discs are uh gba game right here look <laughs> i just <laughs> this guy's op <laughs> yeah wow yeah uh someone said his quirk is that he can make perfect prisons for whoever his quarry is <laughs> it's not a great quirk just like i can um, make the perfect prison you will never escape Ooh, yeah food. that is a pretty great quirk actually if it yeah it's useful in any other context like, than a video game yeah it's useful it's just a little bit lame <laughs> whoever wears the stone toa mask is immune to all splash damage from earth toa weapon they can also <sighs> destroy certain selections of stone terrain okay time for yeah. Vazak, Vaz, Vazonak, both of them, <laughs> probably. The marshy area near the rear of Voyanui is the island's water region. Oh, yeah, I could guess that. <laughs> it always yeah. seems to be night there. Oh no, <laughs> how? 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 <laughs> that's not how solar systems <laughs> work. That's, that's not how planets work. Um, in his aquatic abyss. The water proc of Vizak knows many ways to defeat his, his enemies. Is that like his quirk? That he knows many ways to defeat his enemies? Kind of lame. Oh, I... hold on. That, was, that music is way too peaceful. I mean, it is pretty scenery right now. So. It is, yeah. Uh-oh, it's picking up. Ooh. Lurking Carrier says, marshy area, swamp gas, obscuring local atmospheric conditions. Oh. Maybe, but that wouldn't block out sunlight. Yeah, it wouldn't turn, Maybe the, everyone... it wouldn't turn the sky to stars. Yeah. Maybe maybe everyone's just high and hallucinating yeah, the night sky from here. the swamp gas. That would make sense. That would make sense. Everyone that goes here thinks it's nighttime. Yeah, yeah. Just because of how foggy it is. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Oh wow, it splits. It splits when there's multiple enemies. This is actually a really useful weapon now. All of the big ones are. Big yeah, ones. all the all the final ones are really useful. The the ones you start with are complete garbage. Some biofans says, will silly types of thing be in 1.5 somewhere hidden in Onawahi? <laughs> in some form yes uh not exactly uh the same because he's different different spot and stuff uh but oh wow actually sorry i just looked at my health bar it's huge now yeah um he will he will be in there just in a different form excuse me tanok vizok had the ability to absorb the powers of any creature in close proximity store them and then Use right. them himself later on. Okay, so he's got he's got the the Peter Petrelli power. Oh, yeah. that's a that's a cool looking cow cow. That is pretty cool. Oh, line. Oh. Yeah. Okay. It's... Yep. Line. Line. Just like in the, <laughs> yeah. Like in the Game Boy. But it takes a long time to charge up. Also, I like how the Borok Cause... shoot the same sort of like weird energy discs that they did in Bionicle game. <laughs> right. Right. It's kind of strange sort of crossover, but this is a cool game. <laughs> that's a cool Holly Foes. Uh, the only thing I'm missing here is the um is the from the GBA game the uh, right right uh, the, the, the the victory loop yeah yeah the little victory hias ooh what's, what's going on there I got like little faces I don't know you may have it just turned down a lot <laughs> what is that it's that spiny still paid spiny still is that what it is though I it's can't the tell. only thing that makes sense to me 
or like a crystal climber maybe there, this might be something from like the rahi book because it kind of looks like something that would be in there well i mean both the spiny stone ape and the crystal climber are from the Rahi. oh yeah right so. okay <laughs> <laughs> mr ben asks what's your favorite toa um i always wanted Likan because uh, he had that those two cool weapons that could turn into a surfboard, which I thought was the coolest thing ever. And, and I could never get Lecon because he was the more expensive set, and and my parents would only ever get me the the canister set. Because he so, was uh, he was comboed with the Kikinalo, right? Yeah, yeah, he came with Kikinalo. So also I like gold. So some bio fan says his favorite Toa is Kopaka. Mm, yeah, um, that's a pretty strong one too. I don't know. Again, I'm very unsure about who's my favorite. But I would probably say Kopaka or Onua. Um, right. One of those. Ooh, that's a H, I believe. I actually, I Indeed. disassembled all my Toa Mata recently. Why? Because <laughs> I, I just wanted to put them away. They're now in the box no. with my Terracava. No. <laughs> now we have to do a the stream where you build your Toa Mata and the Terracava. I should just build all my uh, 2001 sets. In on one, on one stream, yeah. 2001 well, speed run. Well, not on one stream. It'd probably be a couple of streams. No, Some no. biofan asked, what made you decide to start streaming? I don't remember. We we sort of, we did, we have been talking about it for a while as sort of a way to engage with the, the fans a bit more. Yeah. Uh, and just sort of uh, talk with them. We were doing uh, weekly, like, blog posts at one point, but that was really hard to maintain yeah. and so we, we decided to do streams as a sort of uh instead of, yeah. of blog posts and it, it made it a whole lot easier yeah oh that was a nice split that <laughs> was yeah i don't remember exactly but i remember we started talking on voice chat a lot more um as we were starting to release togs and then at one point we just said you know what if we did streams and then you know that just kind of happened i don't remember exactly yeah, the reason yeah. why we said that but it just, you know, I, I mean, just it, happened. it's a good way it's a good way to personally engage with the, yeah. the fans and stuff like that so and it's also fun and and, wow, it's, that was a cool split. and it also helps to like because you know fan projects they fail all the time so it sort of alleviates that worry that we're gonna fail as well because we can pop in every week and say hey we've we've still made some progress we're still doing stuff so ah. it gives us that that sort of connection there uh, another another reason why i wanted to uh do streaming some bio fan is because uh i've sort of always wanted to stream but but i've I've never had the confidence to just do it solo, so having people there is way to do it. Yeah, I've done it. I've done it solo occasionally, but it never really works because you know there's not people to bounce off of, which it, I feel like it's is the incredibly best. hard to do yeah. it without bouncing off people. Like I don't, I don't know how some some streamers do it. It's just I couldn't do that. So yeah, you got a thing to read? Oh yeah, just it's head deeper into the submerged shrine, right. which apparently we're underwater now, which I didn't realize. Oh, the van asks, so favorite bionicle piece. <laughs> okay, my favorite Bionicle piece of like all time is the weapon on the Bionicle Stars Baraka. Really? I love that piece. Um, so this is, we're starting to get like, this is how you know we're having a hard time. We're out of, we're out of stuff to talk yeah, about. This we're is like, our favorite this Lego is Oni, pieces. this is Oni's desk sort of yeah, bottom, yeah. bottom bin tier comedy level. <laughs> I don't know what my favorite Bionicle piece is. It's freaking um, the Evoki, the like the the shiny light. shiny mask of life or light. Right. Yeah. Boxer asks if Bionicle was a tree, what sort of tree would it be? <laughs> it would be. I don't the, even know where to begin with. It that. would be the uh, center mangrove tree of a swamp because It'd be of the how, mechanical tree. Yeah, wow. because of how freaking complicated it is. Oh, now we actually have a, a question about Legacy. Ah, yes. If you could add one non-2001 Kanohi to the MLP, which one would it be? Um, um the one that... that Ahoki that and one. Gaha don't count. Yeah, um, <laughs> that one, Daz. You know the one I'm talking about, right? I think so. The one, yeah. Right. Don't say anything about it, but you know I the one I'm talking about. I don't say anything about, about yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. So, yes, uh, we know. You, you can't know. Not yet. So, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So spoilers on that. Yeah. We'll say some bio can also ask, will 2.0 have a joke mode to include all the memes of, in the game, like good guy, Bariki, Makuti, etc. Um, maybe on April Fool's guy, Day. <laughs> maybe on April Fool's Day. Yeah. That's like a holiday. Uh, yeah. 
What's the airspeed velocity of a Nui Rama? I don't know. How big a coconut do you have to transport? Yeah, and uh, is this an African swallow? Is it a, is it a Mata Nui Nui Rama or a Voya Nui Nui Rama? Exactly. And what is the wingspan? Oh, yeah. Also, just by the way, we're supposed to be submerged, but there's the starry sky. I guess maybe I I'm I'm not into the submerged part yet. What what if what if it's a glass ceiling, and those stars are like algae and not okay then stars. Nope. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> but no, no, no commas, man. No. Ooh, yeah, see, it starts instantly now. See, the first one was literally unusable, and now this one's okay. I will say that this one probably looks the worst in effects. This event says, uh, okay, this is a long shot, but hear me out. Bionicle racing game. Uh, mm. spoilers. We're falling in a state of that. <laughs> spoilers. <laughs> I think I know what you're talking about, but, uh, yeah, yeah, um, spoilers, though? Uh, sure. Sure. Um, what are these things again? Dude, look, his head looks like a freaking, uh, a slicer, see? Or, like, um, actually, you know what that reminds me of? This is a kind of a deep cut and really weird reference. That looks like the guy from Cars. The, Mater? No, 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 not Mater. The um, the thing that chased them out of the cow field. <laughs> oh, Frank. Yeah, see? It's got the head shape of that. Kind of, yeah. It's just the head shape. It, it's really just the head shape and like the eyes. That thing was always terrifying to me. I, yeah, it's freaking terrifying. Yeah, they did a fantastic job on that. Do so the next cool. level? What is the next level? This is the last one before the final boss, which then will mean we were finished with the game, technically, aside from uh, secrets. Uh, is there any sort of thing that you want to say about Legacy Joko? Like, it's been a like long time of... coming. Like, I yeah. mean, wait a minute. Is that synth the same one as in Legend of Mananui? It sounds like it. I don't. I don't know. I know I you don't, don't know don't music, know. but this, like, just for anybody watching, it sounds very similar to a song in uh, Legend of Mach Legend of Mananui. But yeah, but Legacy. Yeah, it's Legacy, been a long time coming. Long time coming. Sorry for the two-year delay. We just wanted to actually add stuff to the game, and you'll yeah. see. You'll see why, because um, <laughs> I'm kind of hoping someone will make a comparison video between the two versions. I mean, I it's might even do it. Stark There's a very, yeah. very large difference in even just in visuals, in design, in gameplay, in feeling, in stability. It is very, across very across the board. It is very different, and it's a whole lot better now. Lurkin Carrier says delay doesn't matter as long as it works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's sort of the philosophy that we've been sort of going with. Yeah, although get... two years is uh, like long enough. Yeah. yeah. Like if if I were to just like say, you know, there's no there's no release date, which is what we did for quite a long time, said, you know, just work on it and finish it and it'll be done when it's when it's done. Then it would be like another three years and it's like, OK, yeah. game's finally done, sort of. Cause... Okay, no, especially it's not quite legacy, done, up, you know. Especially with Legacy, where it got to the point where it's just like, you were just the stuff like all the time and there was no, there was no like set plan for what, yeah. like there is with 2.0 where there's a limit on what we can add sort of thing, yeah. you know? Like there, there was no defined scope. Yeah, there was no limit on the stuff, but you know, I did have a list of stuff to do, but it, it kept like mm -hmm. growing and shrinking. So exactly. there was, yeah, exactly. I had to, I had to make a release date so that I could sort of like, you know, stick to that. And and it's, it certainly helped, I think having, cause we've had yeah, this uh, really release date. We've had this release date, like on a soft basis for like the dev side of things for a while now. Yeah. Uh, and we, we've sort like, of been working towards that two, and it's really been pushing so. us to, yeah, it's really been pushing us to, to focus down and get everything ready, so. I have been very stressed. <laughs> Yeah. Some biopen says, I've completed most of the MOP last year, so I'm really excited to see the new content coming later this yep. month. You're yeah, just going to have to replay the entire exciting. game. It's uh, that X different. Van X Van S. How many people work on BMOP? On Legacy, it's basically only Joe Cool. Yeah, on, uh, on Legacy, there's like four people total. On so 2.0 it's, and Togs, it's, it's like 30 people. 2.0, that's where most of the team is currently working right yeah. now. And they're making some great stuff for that as well. Um, we don't have any anything kind of show, release date yeah. for that yet and nothing uh, to show right now so yeah so yeah uh histaban asks 30 people 
how did the group come together slowly over like what is it six years now that we've been yep. working on this project uh, yeah well for me it's been six years but for everybody else it's been five years well i mean for right. for anybody who came in at like the first year it has been so, yeah. very slowly and it was just all from my original game which is legacy and yeah. it was very bad yeah. and now it's a little bit less bad basically people just would apply at uh in the discord and we'd say yeah cool come on board and, and help us out and we do have yeah. a we do have a form uh that you can fill out now it's for like to apply yeah so yeah if you think you've got some skills to contribute by all means even if you don't think you're good enough like yeah there's a lot of people who just came onto the team who knew nearly nothing about anything because like i didn't yeah. know anything about ue4 or coding or very much about modeling before i started making b model and you've you've done a great job with that the the game it. that you've made is is incredibly impressive for our first game also i didn't know anything about ue4 when i joined i had done everything previously in uh unity uh, and so I learned UE4 on on the job. What is that? I got like well, a I got a shield or something. Yeah, you got a shield. What did that do? Uh, I don't know. I think that might be some sort of a secret. And now some bio fan says, "What is your favorite stream so far? Like that we've done? Um, no idea. Hard to say. Yeah. Hard to say. Um, yeah, we've had a fair fair few good ones. Uh, the dub, the fan dub was probably one of the most fun. Yeah. We got to play wacky characters. And yeah, stuff. and it actually kind of turned out surprisingly well. So I think that probably... Lurking Carry says created a rough grid map of the island by stitching together screenshots of areas and measuring the shoreline position on the map, wow. counting steps and scaling from there. <laughs> Holy cow, Lurking Carrier. Why'd you uh, do that? Do we, do we have, like, something we can give him? A gold star or something in the <laughs> Discord? A star. Holy uh, cow. That uh, is... Let's give him a role called Madman. Yeah, yeah, because that's a lot. A lot to go for making a map. Yeah, I mean, dude, that was like the second thing I added. I added that like a year ago. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah. I feel bad now. Yeah. It is, it is also seven. Oh, right, yeah. Um, let's just finish yeah. this, uh... This level? Yeah, because this is the, the last level that we have to do. Yeah, yeah, sounds good, sounds good. <laughs> I love the boss fight music. <laughs> Lurking Carrier says, I did not appreciate trying to search out those damn proto bulls. <laughs> yeah, like I said, we fixed that. Or I Whoa, fixed that. He's taunting me. I can't shoot him behind that. Oh, hello, Kaylee. Is Everyone Kaylee in the chat, say, say hello to Kaylee. Uh, I don't know if her microphone's going to be working. but No, uh, it, it works. I'm just, I, I oh. stay muted. I was trying to turn off the stream so I could just watch it at the same time. Right, yeah. Right, right gotcha. I don't I'm know. just joining yeah. to fill in Peroni because he left. Right. Well, yeah. Yeah. I don't yeah. have the Discord like because I'm in streamer mode. I think they turn off like the Discord sounds. So like when people right. join, I'm not right. I'm not aware of who's joining. Some biofan says put lurking carrier in the hidden section of the wall of prophecy with me in 1.5. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, make him like a map maker or the, something. The Patreon wall. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Basically, at yeah, that, the point. How, how did this level go? Because I wasn't here for most of this. This level, uh, you said earlier it was kind of one of the harder ones. Right? Yeah, it is actually quite hard. Although it's not my favorite one. I think my favorite level so far was the Hakan level because of like the lava rising and the minions. Right. Yeah. Right. That was probably my favorite boss fight. That um, was pretty cool. But this is the water yeah. temple of the game, so of course yeah. it's gonna suck. Basically, uh, it's not Although that I... bad, but it's 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 not the best. Also, I don't appreciate Thok and Vizox ray traced weapons like that because I can't get away. Right. There's no yeah. way to. Yeah. get away from it hit scan <laughs> single one because i remember uh zach tam had the same thing or i could have sworn he did but no no zach tam he just jumps around he's well, he yes. jump around but i i remember yeah. i could have sworn i remembered all of the all of them having like the hit scan just um, hit you with all your thing but... well they might it's just that um it's just that the, these two were particularly noticeable because there's no cover uh oh, right. Right. socks was yeah, literally right. just an island that you had to stand on and you had no way to yeah. protect yourself let's yeah. see sounds kind of like bad game design yep underwater passages right. are easily tra traveled by the wearer yes as i suspect right yes yeah yeah secret areas are also revealed on their radar oh okay so okay. you can find cool. secret areas easier uh i don't think you sort of introduced yourselves usually we we Oh, right. Uh, we didn't introduce we, ourselves this stream either, so it's, it's Yeah, fine. no, they didn't. Yeah. But you guys have been doing this for a long time. But hi, I'm the, uh, I'm the head animator for the team. 
I yes. do all the animations except for the ones that were Not that in much. Legacy. Some yeah. of the ones in Legacy are just like taken from online, especially the Toa. Yeah. Like I, I animate the Toa in the 2.0 version and yeah. do all the other stuff. Uh, you also do like a lot of the combat design, right? I do a lot of the combat design. I came up with a lot of that and ha. had to redo it a whole bunch as well because yes. it is just yeah. like everybody has a different vision for this game. And I'm pretty sure it's some of it also has to do with ASCII's idea of how a physics engine should work. And But in yeah. Legacy, the new update, you will see a little bit of my own personal work <laughs> in some of the animations. And I think that I, I, I think a lot of people will enjoy. Uh, I'm not yeah. going to spoil what that is yet, but I think as soon as people find it, they will know exactly what it is. Yep. So this is very yeah. GT Games uh, unlocked. Uh, what the heck is going it's on? It's disco mode. Oh disco. no. It's it's not great for your eyes. Oh, no. I feel like this would just have issues and give kids seizures. Yeah, and... this is not a great yeah. one to be looking at. Come back and ask, do you guys own any Bionicle Drip? What? I've got no idea what he means. He means uh, like merchandise, wearable merchandise. Right. So close. Oh, oh. It's a uh, slang I'm not familiar with. I don't have any wearable stuff, but I used to have a Tahu Nuva like foam sword and a couple I... of on a I, cow shield. I had the original 2001 uh, Bionicle t-shirt, the one that was like on a black shirt and had the classic right. print. Uh, Jokel, did you ever have anything? I remember I had a... I wore that a... shirt until the print came off. <laughs> Uh, I had uh, Hordika. The, I had the Hordika mask that you could wear of Akama's, oh, Akama's right, Hordika right. mask. That's a long no, time ago. I don't know if you'd call that drip so much as just like the cosplay Yeah, no, stuff, it's just but... uh, that. And um... Unless you really, really were that enthusiastic and went out wearing it all the time. <laughs> no, I did not. Um, I think I had like I... a custom bionicle shirt at some point i don't i don't know i made a a set of like nuva armor for a takanuva cosplay i made one when i was really really young i made it out of cardboard for the later so version this is not right. the final level you have to complete all of these and then you get the vezon yeah, one you get you oh. get the Vezak one with makuda's domain which makes no sense but yeah right well yeah um so yeah that will be next time then you are you trying to set up a wireless game i'm um, just looking it up to see if it's possible <laughs> you want us to play uh, <laughs> first person deathmatch mode or something. I don't know how this actually uh, goes. A reminder, everybody Legacy is coming out on May 22nd. And also, yeah. next week, we will be doing the Bionicle 2 Legends of Metronui fan dub, which could be yep. a complete disaster, Wait. but I don't know, last time it was pretty good. I thought you guys were going to finish this game. Yeah, or well, did you we are. Play? We are, just probably next week and like we're, after. Yeah. Oh. We're taking a break to, to do a fan dub because it's Joko's birthday and we want to do oh, okay. that. But yes, we will be back to this game the week after that. To finish the final level and unlock all the secrets. Yep. Or uh, most of them. Until next time, I've been Zalius. I've been Joko one through one. And I have been the Scarlet one. And may the and great spirit, spirit guide, guide you. you.